Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Grio Garo. Whatever you want to call me, man. And yo, I got this insane new rep method out, man. So I'm gonna help you guys uh, reach whatever overall you guys want. Uh, I actually don't use this rep method a lot, but like whenever I feel like I just need to get a, a certain overall, I'm just use a rep method. So right now, I am at 54.2%, and uh, from now on, I'm gonna just be grinding strictly for 95, so I can make my play sharp. So I'm gonna tell y'all how I'm gonna be grinding and what's a good rep method for uh, sh stretches and sharpshooters. Cause I think that's the only one that can do this uh, this certain rep method. So at the start of the rep method, first I want you guys to go to your my player settings, okay? So when you get into your my player settings, you're gonna need this right exact jump shot, okay? This is gonna gonna be the jump shot that you need to do this. Cause if you don't have this jump shot, it's gonna be every other jump shot is gonna be too slow for you, and you're not gonna be able to get it off in time. So just let Marcus Aldridge as the base. The upper release, you gotta use uh, Rudy Gay. Uh, which is right here and the uh, base two you got to use um, Larry Bird and you want to put that at 60 40 the Larry Bird more side okay there you go 60 40 and then this is the jump shot you guys use okay so I'm gonna name I'm gonna name this one wreck and what wreck or this is actually a good jump shot for wreck also cuz I mean I use it in wreck so that's the jump shot you guys want to use. All right. So after that, I'm gonna bring it. I'm bring y'all out like to the main screen. All right. First, if you're not a 94, this might not work as efficient, but it still will work. You know what I'm saying? So you want to have your your game difficulty on Hall of Fame 12 minutes. Okay. Um, Hall of Fame. It might be hard for some people, but it's not hard. Uh, as as long as long as you get like. As long as you get the like the track of the glitch on what to do, then it'll be easy for you guys. So I am playing the Dallas Mavericks right now. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do this rep method. All right, so the last method I just did, I, I just played a game. So my, my, my percentage is 56.1 now. So I'm gonna play another game and then I'm gonna do the same exact thing. I had tried to show you guys last game, but last game it didn't work out too well. So I'm gonna do it another time right here for you guys. So let me skip right into it. All right, when you guys get in here, uh, just get used to the shot. The shot is pretty quick, okay? So the reason why it's quick is because whenever you do the kicks and shoots, you're gonna need a quick jump shot. So Lamarck is one of the quick and easiest and most consistent jump shots I know. So this is why you should guys use the jump shot. I do not use the jump shot in the park though, okay? So it's just a quick jump shot, just overall. So um, let me get right into this game and I'm gonna show you guys exactly what to do. All right, when you guys get into the game, I don't know who's gonna win this tip off right here. Uh, okay, when you guys get in the game on defense, if you're 94 overall already, you guys want to go left on the D-pad, L2, and then square, okay? So you're going to set a half-court trap so your teammates push everything so everything goes really quick for you. Because to get more rep, you got to be even more faster, okay? So um, as soon as the guard brings up the ball up the court, you want to stand like right here and then ask for the ball. And as soon as you get the ball, pull that up really quickly, okay? As soon as you get the ball, you guys have to shoot, okay? There's no waiting because if you wait, you're going to get contested really easily. So and when you guys are doing this glitch, you guys want to have the highest grade possible, okay? Um, when you guys have the highest grade, um, that means you get more rep for the higher grade you have. Um, so whenever you can, you can also come up the court and just shoot off of that. Um, I mean, I'm not supposed to be getting beat by my man because my grade is not going up like this. But whenever you like, whenever you cross the court, like you can trail, you can trail cheese with the guard, and as soon as you like, you can stay right here, and your man will not guard you. As soon as you get the ball, shoot off of that. Might be a little too deep for me, yeah, because I don't have Hall of Fame limitless. But for you guards, the deeper the shots, the better because you know you guys know you can't get contested from back there. So this is why the uh, this rep method is for all shooters, okay? Because all shooters, you guys have limitless range. You guys can cheese with this. Uh, for other builds like rebound and stretches, as long as you're a sharpshooter first, you can do this rep method, okay? Because it works for every, anybody with gold limitless. And all all these builds have gold limitless at least, so you guys will be able to hit most like the shots most often. Um, here we go. We're in takeover now. You guys don't want to go to immediate tank takeover. You guys want to go to team takeover, okay? All right. Uh, and so while you guys do this glitch, it's best if you guys listen to music while you're doing it, so you can just get into the vibe and just like uh, let time fly pass. Cause I mean, the more the more time you let fly pass, the easier it'd be on you. So you see the guard right here. You can you just set a screen. See, whenever your AI is on you heavy. You just want to pass it right back to the guy and then try to just get get off like get the AI off of you 
because when the AI is on you, they're not gonna let you shoot, but they're gonna back off of you if you uh, if you keep doing this method, if you keep passing the ball, because as soon as you pass the ball, they're gonna step off, and then as soon as you pass it back, they're gonna try to contest you, but you'll be way too quick because the jump shot's too quick for them. So uh, let me show you guys like this, because I think the AI is gonna stick on me heavily. Yeah, he's, held, he's on me heavy now. Watch this. So he's gonna stick on me heavy, pass it right back, Cause this was somebody asked me in the comment section. You just want to keep on passing it back, and he's going to get off of you. Uh, I'm waiting for him to get back, and then I pull up off of that. That should be in there. That was only a small, lightly contest, but you just gotta, you gotta like learn how to master that right there. Because when the AI's on you, they will not let you score whatsoever. So now, when I got got my own rebound. You can also do this behind the back step back move, but at the AI, the AI is really meat riding me right now. So hold on, let me get them off of me. Cause they won't do this every possession. You just have to be really quick with it, just like that. See for sharpshooters, I don't think you guys can shoot over your defender. So it's gonna be a little harder. You guys don't have to step back. So when you step back, you'll be able to like to be like behind the timeline or something. So you guys can pull up from there. So I'm almost at team takeover. So let me show, let me show you guys what to do when you're in team takeover. So let me get this last shot off. Um, if this AI can get off of me. Really and you guys do not want to mess up whatsoever. Because if you guys mess up, <laughs> yo, 2K19 takeover do not play. If you guys mess up, that takeover will be getting snatched real quick. So I got that still. I got my takeover. So now you're in takeover. You just want to shoot. I miss in takeover. Okay, that's crazy. Um, you, got, you guys, I usually don't miss in takeover, so that's weird. But this jump shot is really great for things like that. So you don't really miss that much in the takeover. So when you are in team takeover, you want to double team whoever has the ball so they can pass it to their defender. Just make sure your your, your defender doesn't like move off of his man. So like, look, my defender's going to go off his man. So that's Jaren Jackson's guy. So you just don't, you just don't want to get blamed for anything anybody else does. Because that will mess you up and that will mess up the method. So um, here you go. I got the ball. And so when you get the ball and take over, I'm gonna give the ball to Luca. And then you wanna press L1, press triangle, and then set up fade for your guy. As soon as he hits the screen, pass it right back and get it right, give it back right back to him. And then that'll be that'll work the easiest for him. Alright, so I got the ball back. Um, you guys just wanna you just wanna keep on doing the fade, the uh, just pick and pop with the guy. And with the pick and pop, you wanna be quick as possible. That was a bad shot on my part. Luckily we got the ball back. You want to do the pick and pop with the guard you most usually because the guard usually have a uh, gold dimer and with their gold dimer it's going to upgrade to hall of fame dimer because of the um the uh the takeover upgrades your badge by one so uh let me call my stretch over here and you want to you want to be careful with the screens too because with the with certain screens they will call you for a legal screen you do not want that to happen because then that brings out your takeover even quicker so, I mean, it's not really much to say on what to do. It's just after every team takeover, you get called post phase. I mean, call screen and phase. And that's just really what to do on how this rep method. It's not really hard to know. I just didn't explain it uh, last time. And you guys, um, the shooting over thing is patched. So don't try to just shoot over like how I am. You guys want to try to get the best field goal percentage possible. So it'll be like the easiest on you guys. Cause if you guys don't have a good field goal percentage, you won't get the most rep. Cause last game I only got like 60k and I was aiming for 80k. But the reason why is because I didn't get a good field goal percentage. So the, I mean the rep method is really easy. I just don't take it serious because I'm already a 94 overall. The only thing I'm grinding for now is 95 so I can get my rebirth. So I mean when, you, when I get the rebirth, I won't be touching my stretch most often. But if you guys want me to go back on my stretch, I got you guys. So I'll go back to my stretch. So I just keep on doing this. Oh wait, oh no, that kind of messed up on that. So, and if you guys have the, the center on you, just, just make sure you touch the center with the screen. And then, hold on. God, man, they're double teaming me now. Okay, that, that's gonna have to happen. That's crazy. I did not mean for that to happen. My bad, guys. But um, team takeover, you now guys know what to do. Screen and phase the whole game on team takeover and when you're not in takeover i'm gonna show you guys one more thing on what to do if you're not in takeover because you guys can also dribble because that doesn't affect anything let's go good shot um and i'm gonna i'm gonna teach you guys throughout the video i'm not going to leave you guys hanging during the video but usually i'm just going to do the commentary i'm gonna show some clips in there on what to do also so you guys won't know i like, won't be lost or anything to do on um, what to do 
um I, i'm sorry for not posting also because you guys um i've been really like i've been playing 2k a lot and i didn't, haven't been worried about posting i'm probably playing a lot on my team i'm trying to get off of my team but i just can't leave it but um we're, i'm gonna get some collabs in with some other people and we're gonna try to get this channel even bigger so i can't get this guy off of me so i'm just gonna try to try to crash whenever the ai is on you um your best bet is to try to dribble around them because when your ai is on you they try to stick you like glue so whenever i do that passing thing it kind of won't work sometimes and sometimes it will it depends on how you play it the more you do this the better you'll know like how to get past the ai defenders so it won't be that hard on you guys all right so i'm gonna show you guys how to get past the ai so you want to ask for the ball so the ai is gonna stick me hard so i want to do this behind the back step back move and shoot right off of that so which what i just did right i did a behind the back and then i did a hesitation and as soon as i did the hesitation i shot okay so as soon as you do the hesitation every time shoot off of it because the ai is going to back up and when they back up that's going to give you enough space to get a green okay so you guys want to really pay attention i'm going to do it one more time for you guys so you guys know what to do uh, i mean let me play defense on that you guys want to aim for blocks too blocks give you guys a lot of rep also so i'm, I'm gonna come up the court i'm gonna do a little, do a little dribble and then i mean he didn't even guard me right there look another shot so every limitless shot, it gets you, you need five threes to get to your team takeover. When you get those five threes, you guys will be great, okay? Cause you guys will have team takeover and you will not miss in your uh, team, uh, you guys will, will not miss in your team takeover. Sometimes you might miss and don't get frustrated cause I get frustrated a lot at this micro stuff. That's why I don't play it. I just play part, but now I need to get 95. So I mean, I'm gonna get frustrated a lot. So I'm gonna, so the next video, I should be at 95 for you guys. This should be like the last video for my stretch though. So, I mean, hopefully, if you, hopefully you guys like my new guard, I'm gonna make them and I'm gonna, I'm gonna post, post some videos on them. If you guys don't like my guard, I will go back to stretch. So it's whatever you guys like. All right, so you guys just seen what I did. You guys, I did the behind the back, step back, hesitation, and I scored off of it. It's really an easy move. I mean, and it's not really hard to do. And when you guys, and if you guys aren't a nine, or you know, or not a 94, it's not a 94, let me get my words set. You guys aren't 94 overall. Um, you guys can do the, the high court trap when you're in team takeover with the point guard. So that's just all you guys wanna do. Um, and when you're doing the pick and pops, make sure you're at limitless range so you can only so because you only need 30 limitless shots for this method. Because if you get any more than 30, they start counting them as misses. Because I don't know why you can't put like a patch on how many shots you should take. But I mean, the rep the rep to get rep is already hard in this game. I don't feel like grinding my life out for 99, and I sure don't feel like grinding my life out for 98 and to not get uh, to get a 6 2 mascot. So, I mean, this game's really bad for messing up the rep method. So, I hope next year it will be everything will be way better than usual. So, I'm going to show you guys um, and take over on, like, on, this is a new method, another method to do on takeover to get some rep also. Say if you got enough pick and pops and stuff, you can do the behind the back and then fade off the behind the back green every single time. Okay, just make sure how your AI plays you. If they play you tight, you cannot do a fadeaway because it will get contested really easily, okay? So, um, this should be it, it for you guys. I'm going to show you guys what to do whenever you get 90 points. And if you're not up by 25 points or more, uh, I'm going to show you guys what to do uh, when you get, every, you get 90 points for your uh, my player. So, I'm going to play one more time and then I'm going to show you guys what to do. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hold on. Hold on. The AI is meat riding right now. They're meat riding. All right, so as soon as that happens, bang, bang, green up, green up, stupid. All right, so let me skip to where I have 90 points. All right, when you guys get done getting your 90 points, uh, I haven't got 30 limitless range shots because I know I got I messed up on some, so I know I got to get 99 points, and then I should be at 30 total limitless range shots. And so I'm going to get these last limitless shots up, and then I'm going to show you guys my rep at the end of the game. Uh, please don't tell me that was my fault. That was Lucas. All right, bet. Oh, I think I should get another takeover and just do pick and pops. Yeah, I'm going to get another takeover and do pick and pops so I can get even more reps from this. So, um, it's not it's not hard to do this method. Uh, it's just really like just getting, uh, learning skill, learning on what things to do and like what to do. Like overall, it's not really hard at all. Uh, I'm, I'm actually listening to music right now. It's pretty loud while I'm talking over this. 
but um yeah you guys just finish up the rest of your 30 limitless range shots and then you guys should be set well i can't i don't think i don't think my ai is gonna let me get the last shot but if you guys aren't winning by over 25 points you guys will have to foul out i'm winning by over 25 points so i don't have to foul out and i need my ai to get off of me so i can get this last shot hold on okay they just shot okay i'm just gonna skip it so i'm oh i didn't even get, get over wait how much am i winning by is that 24 okay we gotta we gotta score one more point and then i'm gonna show you guys what to do afterwards all right i got my last limitless range shot so uh, i'm winning by over 25 points i'm winning by exactly 25 so you guys want to x out the sim with vc as soon as you're winning by 25 points and then here's as much rep as i got i didn't go super try hard on this so don't expect me to get the most rep possible uh so this is the little bit of red up rep i got it shouldn't it shouldn't be a lot but i did get this within like 25 minutes it didn't take me a long time i don't really i didn't really play a lot i was really on my phone the whole time at um uh, i was just taking breaks and stuff because i don't take my career any serious because i'm not really grinding for like a top rep or anything look there's 30 limitless range trees uh we got a lot we got 60k we got 60k in 20 minutes so i mean i'm thinking that's great great for me because i don't go try hard and stuff i'm not too worried about anything like that so um 60k in 20 minutes that sounds pretty fair and then every every hour you can get uh 200k an hour so i mean it's not that bad i mean i like it and then you guys can keep on doing this rep method which i'm finna do because i'm grinding for 95 for y'all boys so i get this play shot man so this is your boy grio gyro look at my sexy face creation no homo and i'm on the game coach goodbye